Okay. Well, this uh, partnership is something that I uh, started like six months ago. The main characteristic of this, uh, of this partnership is that we will have three types of benefits. The first of all is the visibility of our logos, or of our brand in the stadium, the digital boards of the stadium. Second, a lot of activities with, in terms of PR, visiting the place, visiting all transport with customers, with consumers, with trade. And of course, finally, one of the most important elements uh, that is using the intellectual property of Manchester United. We can use the pictures of the, of the players, we can use the brand, the crest, and all that to really market those uh, intellectual properties with our wines worldwide. And uh, what do you think uh, you can uh, offer Manchester United as well in this uh, partnership? I think that the, one of the main elements that we can offer Manchester United uh, now in this partnership is our worldwide distribution. Today, Conche Toro is present in 135 countries. It's the number, number one winery in terms of distribution worldwide. And we can really help them building their brand in the markets in which they're not uh, as strong as they want to be. So I think that will be something that we will add. And of course, we will add all the wine world and the wine magic to the venues, uh, to the place, and well, to Manchester United too. And, uh, and uh, so what's... Um what are the uh, areas or the regions in the world that um, they can help improve you get more uh, exposure? They will help us a lot, I think, first of all in Asia, in which Manchester United have been, has been, I don't know, working, visiting, playing with the, with the key, uh, with the big squad in, from 20, 25 years or up to now. So in that sense, they are in a very good position in Asia, and I think that we will be able to benefit from that. Then I would say Eastern Europe, they're also very strong and we will do something. Although we have a good position there, I think that this will really boost our, our position to a new level. And also in the case of Scandinavia, that I think that our markets in which Premier League is very, very important for consumers and having this relation with them also, once again, we will put the, our brands in the next level. And how are negotiations? You said it took six months. I mean, that doesn't yeah. seem too long. It was, went no. quite smooth. Honestly, the negotiation was, from my point of view, it wasn't long. Uh, in the first couple of meetings, we realized that we were talking with, uh, with a company, with, uh, with a club, even with a family that was quite similar with our values. And I think that was the main reason why this negotiation flows really smooth.